the recording. Yes, there we go, you guys. I am so excited that you're here, that you guys are popping on. Okay, White Horse Yukon is the most beautiful place in the entire world. If you guys have never been to the Yukon, please go there. Um, yes, Morgan says, turn on your video if you can, you guys. It is just like, I know sometimes you're like sitting in your PJs and it's super chill and you go, got any makeup on and you're like, I really don't want to be on camera, but like, we're here for it. We're here. We want to be together. We're all in our sweatpants. And guys, I am so excited. And first and foremost, I am proud. I am proud of the 29 women and men that are on this call right now, because there are other coaches who didn't make this call a priority right now. And you have been showing up for yourself. And if you're listening to the recording, I'm so freaking proud of you for listening to the recording, because once again, you're putting in the work for your business. And I am so excited to share with you guys today um, this call, because I hope it inspires you a little bit. I hope it gives you a little bit of an action plan and some guidance as we head into this new month. I also cannot believe that we are on the 27th of February and we are headed into March in two days. Like that's freaking wild. So I'm super excited for you brand new coaches. My name is Brittany Hilko. I am a two-time elite, uh, five-star diamond coach here in Manitoba, Canada. Um, so I have been coaching for it'll be six years in the month of March, which is still mind blowing to me. I say that every single time because I just, I feel like I've been a coach for like two years and that we're just getting the ball rolling. So I am super excited that you guys are here. Um, but I want to share, I just have to, oh, this is so cute. You know, when you wake up some mornings and your eyes just water constantly, that's what's happening today. So I'm going to dive into this, you guys. Um, if I can share my screen, hopefully. Perfect. Okay, can you guys see this screen here? Some of you guys, I'm trying to see who I have on like my screen. Yeah, we can see it. Beautiful, thank you guys. Okay, so I shared this with my team earlier this week and it was actually something that um, one of my friends who is in the business world um, and runs teams. And she was sharing, she shared this on her Facebook and I was like, oh my goodness, this makes so much sense, this entire diagram. Um, and I wanted to share it with you and kind of go through the pieces for success. And this is success with teams. This is success in honestly, whatever you're doing. And it just kind of like blew my mind. So I'm going to dive into this a little bit with you guys today. So First and foremost, when we look at this model for success, we see that there are obviously five little things that equal to success. So first and foremost, I'm just going to break them down. Number one, your vision. For, since day one, vision has been something that has been so important to me and my heart. Um, it was something that not only ignited such a fire in me starting this business, but it was something that pulled me through on the darkest and hardest days. And when it comes to your business, having such a strong vision and a strong why, that is like the backbone to your business. And what I really want you to do is I want you to take a second. And once again, you guys, I usually I forgot the other day and I wanted to share this with you guys. If you have like your cell phone and you're like texting like Becky and Sarah right now, I want you just to put your phone down. I want you to spend this 30 minutes with yourself and the team and diving in um, because you're going to get that much more out of it. If you're scrolling and I mean, if you have kids, I don't, but if they're running in and out, obviously attend to your children. But um, as a daughter of network marketing, I remember my mom would say like, Britt, it's meeting time. I'll talk to you in 30 minutes. So I just wanted to share that with you guys as I dive into this, because I want to ask you some kind of hard hitting questions and something that's going to, whether you're a brand new coach or you're somebody who's been in this business for six, seven, eight years, when it comes to your vision and your goals, I want to understand and know, do you know how the best version of you shows up? Have you sat and thought about how the person who achieves all of her goals, all of her dreams, what she looks like. Do you know how she shows up each and every day? 
right? Have you thought about that? I want you to take like a second and I want you to start jotting on your piece of paper. Or if you are using your phone for notes, I want you to start using your phone and I want you to start jotting. And I want you to ask yourself if everything goes right, if you became, whether it's a diamond coach, a five star, a 15 star, the top coach, whatever is in your soul that like lights your soul on fire for this business. If everything goes according to plan, who are you? How do you show up? What's your team look like? What does your relationships look like? What do your finances look like? How do you act? How do you carry yourself? How are your relationships? And I want you to take a second right now to really drop that out. And you can continue this after our call, of course, and really dig deep and ask yourself, why do I want this? Why do I want to feel like this? Why do I want to keep, keep doing this? And understanding that connecting with that vision, connecting with that why is going to be one of the most empowering things for you in your business. Um, each and every morning, I have um, my own, like, planner that I've created and I have my vision written out and I read it every single morning, whether I don't feel like it, whether days I wake up in a grumpy mood, I connect with that vision and it honestly just like resets my soul on fire. So I want you to ask yourself, like, how do you show up? What do your finances do um, look like? How do your relationships, what's your team like, right? Really understanding that vision of who you want to be. And the secret sauce, that woman, that man, whoever you are going to be and you are creating and you are jotting down and you feel that is going down on that piece of paper, that person isn't going to show up the day that you hit 15 star diamond. That person isn't going to show up when you're an elite coach. That person isn't going to show up when you're an emerald or a diamond coach. You have to become that person today in order to achieve those goals. And that comes on every single piece of this journey from myself, right? I've been, I've became an Emerald coach. I had to make that decision to become a diamond coach, right? To become a diamond from an Emerald, I had to become that diamond coach showing up and taking ownership of my business. I then decided, okay, I want to become a five-star diamond coach, a two-star diamond coach, an elite coach. Growing that way, what that really meant, you guys, was I had to act like that elite coach. I had to embody. I looked at the other elite coaches and I figured, what, what did they do? How did they show up each day, right? How do we grow? And that's when I made the decision to really start showing up in that way. So. You have to become her now. You have to show up as her right now. Um, the next one, skills. Guys, you got to be proof of the product, right? We're in a business that shares incredible products from Energize, Shakeology, Digestive Boost, Greens, Hydrate, the workouts, right? We have so many incredible tools that we offer to people. But guess what? You're probably, if you're like, oh, nobody seems to stay on Shakeology when I sign them up and stuff like that, or nobody buys Energized. Well, I want to say like, have you ever shared or talked about it? Are you, are you sharing how important it is, how it makes you feel, right? Are you getting results? And I'm not talking about, of course, like the perfect before and after photo, right? Who are you before and who are you after? How do you feel before you started Bar Blend and how you feel after Bar Blend, right? As we have gut protocol coming up, right? Why are you excited to dive into the gut protocol program? Start sharing that on your social media, right? Go and learn about it in the back office and think, why is this going to be good for me? Why do I, why should I focus on my gut health, right? Oh, it's going to improve my mood. Great. I've been in a February funk for the last little bit, right? And this is going to feel so good for my body. 
start sharing that journey. And as you go through that program and finish that program, you're going to be once again, the proof that the product works. You're going to be able to talk about it. You're going to be able to share about it. Um, so in your skills, that's once again, proof the product works. It's inviting, right? Inviting is a skill in this business. And guess what? You're not going to be perfect when you first start, right? I remember, and I know Morgan and Jen will laugh at this too, is like, we used to send like novels to people, like just absolute novels to human beings to be like, come and join our team. And now we're just like, oh, okay. We've refined that skill a little bit, but guess what? We all have to start somewhere. We all have to have that beginning as we grow in this business, right? We all started at that first invite where we word vomited on somebody, right? Um, so it's a skill that you're going to be refining. Another skill is going to be connecting. Another skill is going to be your social media. And guess what? You're not going to be perfect at all this stuff at once, but you're going to be able to grow and evolve this stuff from day one. And if you are comparing your social media to any coach on this team or any coach in the network, I would love for you to just take some time and scroll to the very beginning of their Instagram and see what their before photos look like. Um, because guess what? We all weren't perfect at social media. We're still not perfect at social media. It's ever changing. So be messy with it. Continue to grow. Incentives is number three, right? Um, so this business, you guys, we have so many incentives. We have the, um, Income opportunity is first and foremost the biggest one, right? We got the income opportunity. Um, there's prizes for a success club, right? You have the one month, three month, six month. Um, you guys probably saw a few coaches and maybe even yourself received the Ray-Ban sunglasses um, that we got for Achieving Success Club every single month last year. And this year it's like a Lulu jacket. Um, so there's incentives, rewards, there's prizes. And honestly, one of the coolest incentives that I find so many people overlook is the growth. The growth in the person who you were when you started this business, the growth of the person that you were before you sent that first invite, the growth in that person that you were before you started and finished a program, right? We overlook that so often, right? We're so, we have our blinders on so much sometimes that we forget what, what have you just walked through? How are you still showing up? How are you still growing through all of this, right? You have to understand that like who I was before I started coaching you guys, who I was in 2018 as a coach, who I was last year as a coach, to who I am today, the growth is crazy. And I think that's one of the most beautiful incentives that we so often overlook. Resources is our next one. Number four is resources. So guys, you are a part of an incredible team that gives you simplified resources. So we have Facebook groups for resources, right? We have YouTube videos. We have the coach online office, right? We have Google books, podcasts. There are resources left, right, and center in this business, right? There are so many places that you can be growing. Um, for myself, I'm somebody who I love spending time each and every day, kind of in my like growth um, resource mode where I'm going into different groups and different podcasts and learning and growing and talking to other leaders and understanding what's working for for them, right? If you're somebody who is pushing towards, you're growing your business to become an emerald coach or a diamond coach, these resources that you have access to, this is you first and foremost, giving yourself permission to become a, um, a business owner, a CEO in your business and understanding, oh, guess what? It is up to me. It's up to me to treat this business like a business just because Karen, who I run my business with, isn't moving her business to diamond doesn't mean that I can't. So I'm going to go find the resources to achieve diamond. I'm going to go look at all the YouTube videos from all of the coaches who have shared their tips and tools and resources to become that diamond coach. I'm going to have that on replay so I can start acting like that diamond coach and I can start using my skills and inviting. And maybe I learned something from those resources to implement that are going to change and help me get there. <laughs> 
right? So you have unlimited resources to be successful in this business. Um, and that comes from like our up, 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 up line to being on one of the like most incredible teams that gives resources, right? We are a part of the dynasty, like, we'll, we'll just leave it at, we're, we're part of the dynasty, you guys, um, which is like one of the most successful teams in Beachbody, right? And it's because of the tools and resources that we have. And lastly, it's the action plan, right? The action plan to put it all together to grow your business, right? How to build to Success Club 10, how to build to Success Club 5, how to build to Emerald, the road to Diamond, right? The road to Elite. We have those action plans, right? At the start of this month, we talked about that road to Elite, the Success Club points, the volume, all of those stuff. That's a roadmap and an action plan to get you to where you want to go. As we head into the month of March, right? Sit back and think, okay, what are my goals? What are my goals for this upcoming month? How do I want to, what do I want to achieve in the month of March, right? Do I want to help 10 women get started with the gut protocol? Do I want to become a diamond coach? Do I, whatever your goal is, right? And I want you guys to like, some of you are already like thinking about them right now. And I want you to put them in the chat. What are, what's like a goal that you have for the month of March? Diamond success club, whatever it is, I would love for you to put it in the chat. So coming from that, you guys, is now we need to make that action plan on how to achieve that, right? If your goal's diamond, sweet. Make sure that you put out that diamond roadmap, start plugging in what you have, and then start adding the people that you need to go from there, right? Understand that action plan to get there. Success Club 10, amazing. Grab a piece of paper, make five lines. That's your Success Club 10. Start filling those out and don't stop until those lines are filled out. So often we stop before we get there, right? We stop before we achieve our goals because Becky said no, right? Or not right now. And we got discouraged, right? Our ego got hurt a little bit because why didn't she want to join us? When in reality, maybe it wasn't time for Becky to, to join us, right? So let's keep going until we do find the incredible women who do want to join us. So you might be thinking, okay, oh, yeah, Britt, like this is sweet, but like, why are you really like sharing this? Like, I really don't like, okay, cool. We got five steps to see success, like cool. But this is kind of the impactful thing that I wanted to share with you guys. This is that same board, but you're going to see the missing pieces because every single one of you on the goal that you're working towards right now that success goal that you have, whether in up here, whether we put success as success club five, success club 10, diamond, elite, two star, five star, insert your $500 a month, whatever your goal is, you're putting that in the success part right there. Okay. Now, as we go down, every single one of you on the, on that way to achieving that goal, there's a piece missing, right? And now understanding what each one of those sections is, we can figure out what is actually happening, what is actually going on. So the first one, hey, we got vision, right? We know where we're going. We got the skills, right? We're sending the invites. We're excited to get that like cross bag that they're giving us. Um, we got the resources and success club, but like, what the F am I supposed to do? right? So you like sit down, it's Monday morning, you're like ready to rock and roll. And then you like freeze. You're like, oh, what, what am I like? Is success club? Like I thought about it. I did my personal development. I thought about hitting success club 10, but that leads to a false start, right? We're not actually taking those steps. We don't have that clear action plan to get to where we want to go. The next one, missing the resources, right? We got the vision, we got the skills, we got the incentives, but we're missing the resources and we have the action plan. The what warms my heart so much is knowing that we are part of a team that if you feel like you are missing resources, that's just because you are not allowing yourself to be successful. Because every single one of you who was a part of this link to get onto this call is a part of a team that is filled with resources. So the only reason why you don't have the resources 
to, to build to whatever your goal is, is because you're just not allowing yourself to do it, which leads to frustration. So you have to give yourself permission to go and learn about how to hit success club. You have to give yourself permission to actually go and finish that new coach training. You actually have to give yourself permission to use those tools and resources to get you there. Right. And that takes away that frustration. Next one resistance, right? You just like, you feel that like you just, you can't, right? You know what you want. You have the skills, right? Your social media is amazing. You have the resources, you're using them. You know your action plan, right? You've got your diamond roadmap, your success club five roadmap, ready to rock and roll, but you're, you're missing those incentives, right? You're, and, and I think kind of the biggest thing with this, right? We go back to those incentives when it was our income, it was, um, whether it's a retreat, it's prizes that you're going through, the growth. If you're feeling resistance in working your business, right? Hands up if anybody's kind of felt resistance before. Like you want to work your business, but you're just like, oh, like, I don't know. Like there's just something that's, that's holding you, right? And you're just not sure. Sometimes we're, um, I think a lot of us, well, I know for a fact, every single one of us is wired differently. What sets my soul on fire and in earning income and the growth aspect is going to be different for somebody else. So you need to understand what incentive drives you, right? What incentive drives you? Is it the growth aspect? Is it an income? Is it a prize? Whatever it is for yourself, you need to understand what incentive drives you in this business. And if it's like something that like Beachbody doesn't do, well, guess what, you guys, maybe your incentive is going and getting your nails done. Maybe the incentive is putting your phone down on Saturdays. Maybe the incentive is going and purchasing that new book or like you have to figure out what that incentive for you that's going to drive and set your soul on fire, right? And that is totally personal and you need to dig deep and understand what that is because my reasoning to diving in and going after the goal to be a three-time elite team is going to be so different from Morgan and Jen and Kristen and Jamie and Steph and everybody else who's pushing towards elite this year, right? So you need to understand why is diamond important to you? What is that going to do for you? The next one, anxiety. I know a lot of you have felt this before. You're like, I know what to do, but like, oh, I just, I can't do it. Same. It's similar to that resistance. It's in your belly. You're just not sure about it, but what's missing is those skills. And here's the beautiful thing. You guys, every single one of you has access to YouTube. Every single one of you has access to the beach body champions page. And in there, you guys, not only are there incredible trainings, teaching you how to invite, teaching you how to, um, be on your social media, how to connect, but there's also those incredible action hours and power hours that you can just grab your phone, put on, um, put on an action hour and listen and take action alongside of those top coaches that are teaching you. So you don't feel so alone sending those invites, right? So you don't feel so alone figuring out how to um, make your post or what to say, right? This is so simple. And for me, you guys, like I've been working by myself. And I mean, I was, um, I was a full-time coach like so many of us before the pandemic, but I would still get together with a lot of my coach friends and work alongside of them. But when we were like stuck in our homes and couldn't see anybody, Hopping onto those recordings or those live power hours each day, like change the freaking game. It makes you feel not as alone. It takes away that anxiety. And it is so incredible for you to be a part of that. And lastly, you guys, you know, maybe, maybe it's a coach that you sponsor, right? Maybe it's your success club partner. Maybe it's you where they're just confused, right? They're like, this coaching thing sounds great, but they're just not taking any action whatsoever. And they don't understand the why behind the invites, the understanding, the roadmap to success club, right? They, they have everything sitting out in front of them. They have that beautiful folder that they made in November with Morgan, right? They have that awesome folder, but they're not taking any action because they don't understand why. 
And that comes back to that very beginning question of when everything goes according to plan, who are you? How do you show up? Who's that person that you're going to be? Who's that coach? How does she show up, right? Understand that vision, whether it is a short-term vision, a short-term goal. Hey, if I hit Success Club 10 this month, that means I've paid for my um, products and I earned an extra, like, I don't know, $70 and I can fill a quarter tank of gas, like whatever that goal is. Right. Um, or maybe it's the long-term, Hey, I know that if I'm consistently hitting success club 10, I'm going to be able to do X, Y, and Z in this business. Right. Maybe it's, Hey, guess what? I know that if I'm, it might be once again, those short-term goals or else it might be that long-term vision right? So many of my mom friends right now, I think it is, I get such, oh, I get such a knowing in my gut and in my heart that I'm on the right path, you guys, because um, so many of my mom friends um, who just had babies who are struggling going back to work right now. And they're like, man, I just wish there was another option. I just wish there was another way that I didn't have to go back Um, to work and I could just be a stay at home mom, but that just isn't real life. And I'm like, bro, that is the only reason why I'm building this business. The days that I don't want to show up in this business, you guys, the days that I don't want to send out the invites, the days I don't want to sit down and make an action plan to building to elite, to signing up five new coaches, to doing an action hour. I sit and think fast forward five, 10 years from now, when I'm at like my kid's ball game, And I didn't have to book off work, right? Or my kid calls me because they forgot like their lunch, right? Maybe this is a little further than 10 years from now. But you know, like I sit and think of that freedom that we get to create in this business. And of course, Beachbody is not guaranteed any level of income. It's all up to the hard work, due diligence, and focus of the coach, talent, effort, all that good stuff, Beachbody income disclaimer. But you guys... I think this graph is such a beautiful thing and a tool for you to have in your business and in knowing and an understanding that, hey, guess what? When I can identify that one area, it doesn't mean you're a bad coach. It doesn't mean that you're not going to be successful. It doesn't mean whatever story you're telling yourself right now. The reality is you just have to identify where you're needing to grow into. And I always say this, new level, new devil. So whether you're an emerald coach building to diamond, a diamond coach building to one star, you're hitting success club five and now you wanna hit success club 10, guess what? That's gonna take a new version of you, a new level for you to dive up into or build into, right? You're going to have to up level yourself to get there. And I, every time people think, talk about that like leveling up area, I don't know why, but I always picture like Mario games when he's like running and jumping over those like tubes and stuff like that on like our N64s. Um, I always think of that because he had to master that first level before going to the next level, right? You had to be really good at that video game before you could go to that next level. It's the same thing in life. It's the same thing in business to get to where you want to go, to get to where you want to grow to you guys. You have to understand how does that diamond coach show up? What are they actually doing? Oh, they actually are filling out their business activity tracker. They actually are sending out 10 invites a day or 10 invites five days a week, whatever it is. You need to understand what that coach does and how they show up. But now you can identify what's that missing piece. And the best part is you get to lean into that now. You get to lean into that area that you're missing. And guess what? Once you've put all that tools and resources and understand what's missing, you get to put it back together. And then you can get that ball rolling in that momentum. So let me stop the share. Does anybody have any questions about that? Um, Questions, comments. I did not look at the chat because we all know I'm super squirrely. So any questions, you guys? Perfect. Um, Unless they're typing. But um, guys, we have two days left in um, the month, right? We got today. We got tomorrow. You still have time to go and achieve your goals from this month. You still have time to like 
put pedal to the metal and go after your goals, go lock in success club, go lock in emerald, go lock in diamond, go lock in emerald. And again, and again, and again, right. You still have time to achieve your goals. And the only difference between you and achieving your goals is the action that you take. So whether you need to tell your family, you know what, I got this like fire in my belly right now. I need one hour and you go like blinders on and crush your business for one hour. That's going to feel so much better than being like, oh, I should work my business and kind of floating around, you know, get focused, get diligent on exactly what you need to do. Have that action plan, check it off and make it happen. So you guys, I just want to thank you all so much for spending the month of February with me. I can't believe that we're already done. Um, AMQ is going to be our host next month. Uh, the recordings will be uploaded into Success Clubber so you guys can use this, share it to your teams, all of that goodness. And I just want to thank you guys so freaking much um, for joining us. Um, and yes, there's some um, power hours and action hours that are posted in our team page, all that goodness. But I just want to thank you guys and I hope you have an amazing Sunday um, and go and freaking rock the rest of the month, okay? Love you guys. Chat soon. Yes, let's do a boomerang because everybody's on here. Okay, also my team will laugh. So if you guys do have your phones, like use your phones also. Be also because I won't be able to take everybody. But it was my goal for 2022 to become good at the Zoom boomerang because uh, it was not good. So. Clean this off, you guys. Okay, ready? We'll do a three, two, one. And then everybody like move, wave, peace sign, do what you got to do. Okay, ready? Three, two, one. Awesome, you guys. I freaking love it. Thank you guys so much for this month. Thank you for popping on and go and crush it. I'm so proud of you. And I can't wait to like hug and actually squeeze you guys at Super Saturdays and su Summit that's coming. It's going to be amazing. Okay, bye you guys.